but I'm back in the country and I'm so happy to be back. Though I have been traveling to China with one of my best friends, Julia, to go see another of my best friends, Katya, who actually lives there. She lives uh, in Shanghai and she and her husband, Alex, were so nice to invite us, go meet them and uh, just to see this incredible country incredible city and to feel this incredible culture so yeah i'm just so happy that i've been there and i met my friends julia and katya at school so we've been best friends ever since so it was also a really good time for us to reconnect and to recollect all together in china so yeah i'm just so thankful and grateful for this trip if you want to check out my china vlog it's on my channel the link is down below so let's just go back to the video anyway can you believe that the last month of this year is here and new year and christmas is next in a few weeks i know i just can't believe it, I'm so excited and I love winter so much. I'm really looking forward to the holidays. And today's video I thought I'm gonna do something a little bit different with my graphic design stories because a couple months ago I did a video called Digital Drawing in Photoshop, Three Steps and that video was really popular and I asked you if you want me to create a tutorial for you on digital drawing in Photoshop and a lot of you said yes so I'm gonna show you how to learn digital drawing in Photoshop step by step and this way you can learn how to draw digitally and at the same time uh, you can just enjoy designing and once you're done with your design work with your digital drawing process you can then easily print it on a Christmas card and gift it to your parents or friends because I think it's a little bit more special and meaningful and uh, plus it's perfect when you don't really know what to get them and you don't want to spend a lot of money so yeah let's just get started our digital drawing process so as I have mentioned in my previous videos, I have been drawing since I was a child and a big part of this my drawing experience was drawing on a paper and it's only been on the last two or three years that I made this transition from drawing on a paper to drawing digitally. So what do I use? I mean what tools do I use to draw digitally? So as for my software, I'm going to use the program which you all know from my previous videos. The program is called Photoshop and I think it's great. It's really easy to start with your drawing process. And sometimes it even feels like I'm drawing on a paper. And as for the hardware, the hardware I'm going to use today is uh, also the tool which all you know from my previous videos. It's my Wacom Intos tablet and I think it's really great, it's really professional and really enjoyable to work with. And also it's really comfortable because, for example, you can be drawing on your computer or you can just be out somewhere on a restaurant or sitting in a park and uh, with your laptop and still be drawing. So it's a great comfortable tool to use also. So let's just go ahead and get started our drawing process in Photoshop, which consists of three steps, sketching, drawing and coloring. And today we're going to focus on step number one, which is the sketching step. So let's get started. So I love Christmas holidays and I love drawing. Drawing is like a part of who I am. So I decided to show you today how to create these amazing, very simple doodle drawings in Photoshop so that you can learn how to do it and also gift your creation, your art to someone very special for the holidays. Because I myself would like to receive any of these. Once you're done with three steps of drawing in Photoshop, then you'll be able to print it on a Christmas card or a mug for someone who's into coffee or tea or a gift tag. So I really hope you enjoy this video and let's get started. I'm in Photoshop now, I opened a new file and then the next thing I'll do is I will now start our drawing and we will do that in three steps. In the first step we will create a rough sketch for the illustration and in the second step we will do the final drawing, in the third step will be about coloring. So now for the rough sketch we will create a new layer 
and it is a good time to give some names here. This layer is gonna be a rough sketch. Now we make ourselves a bit comfortable diving into our illustration and now we're trying to sketch some things we have in our head connected with Christmas. And in this step it's really not about defining final detail. It's more about being inspired by our concept in our head and finding the elements and getting the attitude of characters. For example, our snowman should look really positive and at the same time really relaxing. Maybe dancing, they are really relaxing here. And you notice that I'm going really fast here, because once again, this is not the step to define details, it's only the step to do a rough sketch. And plan ahead and see where all the elements will get into place. Now this looks quite nicely. Before we get into too much details, we stop our sketch. And this is quite the thing I was looking for. A rough sketch of our Christmas illustration. Based on that, we are ready now to do the detailed drawing. So this is it. This was step number one of my digital drawing process in Photoshop. And stay tuned for steps two and three next weeks. And once again, if you want to get into digital drawing, then I highly recommend you start using this Wacom Intuos tablet which is really great and it's not a commercial, I just really like it, I use it all the time. And I just hope that after watching this video you will open your Photoshop program and start using this tablet and just go and draw something. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye!